Hello, my name is Trisha with Avaya Global Service Support. This video is about how to schedule and perform a sys backup in CS1000E system. This video will tell you about how to schedule a sys backup and how to create a sys backup on a Linux server CS1000. I have logged in to CS1K 7.6 Linux server and typed the command sys backup. I have got four options minus R is to remove the sys backup task from the schedule minus s shows the backup task scheduled settings minus b execute one time backup minus c set up a backup schedule sys backup minus c will be used to set up a backup schedule so i am setting up a backup schedule it will prompt you to enter option 1 or option 2 option 1 is to backup to a usb device and option 2 to a sftp server I'm selecting option 2. It asks you to enter the secure SFTP IP address. Enter the IP address. Enter the SFTP login username and the password. Enter the remote SFTP directory where the backup will be stored. By default, I have selected as home at ad users srisha and the system prompts you to check whether the information entered is correct or not. If the information is correct, select yes or why. Then the system prompts, do you want to use the default backup time that is midnight Sunday? I select no and the system prompts to enter the minute at which time you want to take a backup uh, I'm giving 23 hour at 22 enter the day of the month uh, let me put it a second enter the month uh, let me put it on the fourth and enter the day of the week you can put asterisk or star so it backs up daily So once it is done, you can review the sysbackup scheduled by using the command sysbackup-s. Next, we'll perform a one-time sysbackup. We'll type the command sysbackup-b. Select the option 2 to backup to a SFTP server. Enter the secure SFTP IP address. Enter the login name and enter the username and password. And the location where you want to store the backup then the backup starts you can see it is executing all the scripts to backup BCC base JBoss and other things it will take some time then you can see it is taking the call server backup where it is adding the loadware and the patches and the IPMG data. It also backs up the patches on the call server. The Sys backup does not perform a call server backup. So Calls for backup should be done immediately prior to issuing the sys backup. Then the backup is created with the name of hostname, date and time with the size it mentions. Then it asks you do you want to continue? select yes then the file will be transferred from the Linux base to the SFTP server here you can see the file is getting transferred it will take for some time and finally it says the backup is complete thank you for your time today 
We welcome comments and questions and feedback at mentor at avaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details or related information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.